I, I am breathing. Breathing exercises. You just... It's so simple. Just inhale, hold, exhale, uh, hold. No, oh, I can't remember. No. Don't, don't, don't say that. I mean, I know I'm okay. I... I got this. It's not fair that you run out and do everything for me. D just because... Just because I'm... Shy. That's an understatement. I'm not even qualified to be called a human. I mean, I know we're all different, but... Why am I like this? This seems a little bit extreme. Well, you're sitting here having to give me a pep talk to go out and get necessities, and... I'm trying to remember how to do breathing techniques. <sighs> Thank you, though. Your kind words do mean a lot. No, I'm not staying home. Not again. Not again. You know what? Every step matters. I can make it to the car. I can listen to some lovely songs and, and then we'll get there. We'll get what we need. And we'll go home. Easy. Simple steps. As long as I forget about everyone. Maneuvering around everyone. Pretending no one's there so I can make it through the day. But I need, I need to do this. Not just for me, although that's very important. <laughs> you shouldn't have to do everything by yourself. I've been... I've been so selfish, leaving everything to you. While I care for things around the house. It's not fair. Especially since you help around the house, too. Lately, I've been feeling like a burden. Like I'm just here. And that's not right. It's not fair to you. And besides, when we're together, we, we work better. We're better together. I just have to keep telling myself that. And that you would never just abandon me. I know that once we get there, you'll be by my side no matter what. <laughs> I won't just be left and having to maneuver everything by myself. I'm fine. I'm fine. Sorry. This would be so easier if I wasn't like this. We'd probably already be there by now. <sighs> Maybe I am a burden. Oh, sorry. I know. 
You don't want me to say things like that. I guess I shouldn't want to say things like that either. Okay. Just think. I can hold on to you. And... And just breathe and... and I... Sorry, every time I close my eyes, I... Imagine all the people staring at me. No, I'm... I'm not gonna close my eyes at the store this time. I mean, it's helpful. But I have to help pick out stuff, too. What's the point of me going if I'm not helping? Just to be there and possibly be in your way? I'm tired of being annoying, of constantly clinging on to you and look at me, I'm doing it right now. How long have I been holding on to your arm? It's like I subconsciously just, I know that you're my safe place. And I get clingy, and, and I don't want to let go. Maybe that's why I've been feeling a little confident. Because I've been holding on to you. It's so natural now that I forget that I'm even doing it. I mean, you are very comfortable and I do feel a little better but that's gotta be embarrassing going to the store and me just holding on to you like a scared whatever <laughs> see I can't even think of a good word I'm just a thing, a scared thing, a clingy, annoying, um, yeah, I was gonna say obnoxious, sorry, yeah, need to not be mean to myself, okay, and I keep telling myself that we're better together, but I'm better when we're together. It's not like I do anything to be helpful for you. I'm just here. You're always the helpful one. <sighs> no, I'm not thinking mean things about myself. Of course I am. <laughs> you know me. But I don't say it out loud. I think it inside my head. I got this. It's time for me to be helpful. It's time for me to keep my eyes open and and actually do something. Because I'm tired of telling myself that I am a burden. That you would be better without me. But I'm selfish. I don't want to be without you. I can't imagine you being with anybody else. You're the only one I'm really comfortable with. Even with all the noise and all the people and... And the statues, oh, I just feel like the statues stare and, but with you, everything's okay. Everything's not perfect, but close. And it's only not perfect because of me. Okay, I want to be helpful. 
I, I love you, you know? And... And I will be hopeful. I won't be a burden. Okay, I think I'm ready for the car ride now. And then maybe another pep talk before going in.